we continue actually our coverage of Biden's visit to Yonkers with News 12's Jonathan Gordon, who is outside the venue. He reports on the local reaction to the rally. It was peaceful outside Sarah Lawrence College as a mostly pro-democratic crowd waited hours for a chance to see President Joe Biden and Governor Kathy Hochul. It's monumental. Voters said they hope to hear more about Hochul's plan for the economy, education and public safety if given a full term. Loose days need to, you know, really unite each other and fight this wave, you know, this craziness that's going on in America. The people just got to band together and go out and don't lose faith, don't lose hope. Just go out there and vote like your life depends on it. The president's historic appearance in Yonkers is the latest push from Democrats to motivate their party to go out and vote. This is a close election. Westchester's in play, and you can't win Westchester unless you win Yonkers. We want accountability. Several supporters of Congressman Lee Zeldin and former President Donald Trump also made their voices heard. Zeldin, at least he's, um, you know, saying the right things. And let's give him a shot, see what he does. Both Biden and Hochul express urgency for voters to turn out, with the polling showing a too close for comfort governor's race and several Hudson Valley congressional seats in jeopardy of flipping from blue to red. With election day just around the corner, only time will tell if this visit truly paid off for Democrats. For News 12, I'm Jonathan Gordon.